Hi, I'm Miss Kelly, and I'm the ballet director here at RDC. And this is Scarlett. Hi. And she's gonna model a ballet bun for us. And this is really great for recital time. So if you wanna have a nice, clean hairstyle and your choreographer wants you to be in a bun, then you can follow this video. And this is Miss Kristen, this is Scarlett's mommy. And she's going to be showing us her supplies. All right, so for a basic ballet bun for recital, um, if you don't have a lot of hair, you're going to want a hair donut. They come in multiple colors. There's a dark brown, a black, this is a lighter one. You want it to match as close as possible to the kid's hair so that it's not showing through on stage, especially for our little blondies that are up there. Um, I personally use both hair pins and bobby pins. Bobby pins are your tighter ones and your hair pins are your wider V ones. Um, your bobby pins are going to secure your bun piece and these ones kind of tuck in your um, loose ends at the end of it. You will also need two rubber bands and again you want something close to your child's hair color so it's not standing out on stage. Sorry, phone. And a hairnet if your kid has a lot of flyaways. I'll show you how to use it in the end. Kind of hard to see in my hand right now but a hairnet um, is really helpful for keeping that bun nice and secure. And to start their ponytail and make it nice and sleek, I like to use water and hairspray and sometimes a little bit of gel or a smoothing cream, but for today's tutorial, I'll just use some hairspray and water to start. Okay, so we're gonna brush all the hair out. And a little bit of water. The water helps make the, the hairstyle um, sleek and it also helps hold it in. Sometimes if you don't do that, especially if your hair is clean, um, you'll get a lot of flyaway hairs and it'll actually look kind of messy. So if your hair is wet and or a little dirty, <laughs> it's actually really good for a pulled back hairstyle. And on stage, you have these stage lights shining down on you. And if you have little flyaways or wispies, the lights make them sh uh, stand out even more. This nice clean bun is also really great for class. A bun is going to be well, part of our dress code for ballet, but for any dance style, it's going to help your dancer concentrate on what they're doing so that they're not distracted by hair in their face, especially if it's a turns and leaps class or a class where they're turning a lot. Ponytails can whack you in the face sometimes and it can actually throw off your spot and your balance. So having a nice clean hairstyle that's pulled out of your face will help with that. So we're making a ponytail. And for a ballet bun, we want the bun to sit at the crown of the head. If you drew a little imaginary line from the ears up to the crown of the head, that's a nice location for the bun. It's also going to help the dancer lift their head and lengthen their neck. So it's going to help their posture, actually, if the bun is nice and high. You don't want it too high right on the top of the head, but on the crown of the head is good. So we're spraying with a little hairspray and then pulling the hair back again with a little comb or you can use a brush. Um, that's gonna help get those wispies pulled back. And I always call this helmet hair. So it should, it should be shiny and smooth like a helmet. You don't want a lot of hair sticking out. So far, so good. Here's our donut. Okay, so the donuts are really good for the younger dancers, or if you have fine hair in general, the donut is gonna make the bun um, round and uniform. So you just stick the donut through the ponytail. And again, you wanna try to find one that's close to the hair color of your dancer just in case the hair doesn't cover it all the way and then you've got some peeking through. If it matches the hair, then you won't be able to tell. So Kristen added a little more water and then she's gonna smooth the hair over the bun, the bun donut. 
and you want to make it even all the way around if you, if you can. So it's sort of like separated right in the middle of the ponytail and then it's draping over the donut in all directions. After that, you're going to get a ponytail holder that matches the color of the hair and you just place it over. A little more spray or a little more water is always helpful. So then you're going to take all that extra hair that's um, around the outside of the donut and you're going to make little sections. So if the dancer has thick hair or long hair, you can make more sections. And if the dancer has thin hair, um, you can make one or two sections. So Kristen's got the bobby pin and that's like the closed sort of pin and she's pressing it in around the base of the donut. And the donut is like spongy, so the pins can go right through. And that's gonna help secure it. How's it feel, Scarlett? Good. Feels good? Okay, so now she's making four sections? Yeah, I do four for her, just to keep it nice and tight. Four sections. Scarlett's got oh, pretty thick hair. And the more you practice this, the better you will get and the quicker you will get. So I recommend trying this before recital if you haven't done this before. And any hairstyle for your recital dance for that matter. So she's twisting these little sections around the donut one at a time and securing them in. And the reason we do different sections is so that it looks even all the way around the donut. So then after that, we'll go ahead and spray with hairspray. Yeah. Again, that's just gonna make everything look really sleek back clean for pictures this is also really important for our picture week okay yeah so we also can use a hairnet you want to find a hairnet that's close to the color of the dancer's hair and you can find these at CVS you can order them online I think maybe Target might have them or something but you just wrap it around a couple of times and this is gonna be really great to absolutely 100% make sure that your bun stays in and there are no little wispies sticking out. And it stays pretty well. And that's it. So Miss Scarlett, you wanna stand up and just model your hair for us? Beautiful, turn around a little slowly. Okay.